YouTube, are all Liberian beneficiaries of DED uh, if they are in the U.S. after Jan January 1st, 2021? I didn't hear the first part because you were muted. Uh, can you hear me now? I do. Okay. Um, Charles Williams on YouTube, are all Liberian ben beneficiaries of DED if they are in the U.S. after January 1st, 2021? Yes. Daniela Charles on YouTube, who is qualified for the matter of cesse? What are the requirements? Matter of cesse is people who came on a fiance visa. They got married and the spouse provided an affidavit of support, but did not complete the immigration case. The fact of getting married and having an affidavit of support by the spouse is enough as long as you can prove it was a bona fide marriage, even if you got divorced. It is a special way to get a green card for people who came on K-1 fiancé visas who ultimately didn't really have a successful marriage and the marriage broke up. Steve Kahn on YouTube, I am in the F-1 category and got approved by USCIS. My priority date is October 16th, 2016. How long is the wait? Uh, about another year. Um, so Jaka Jaka on YouTube, if someone is on H-1B and receives a stimulus check in his or her bank account, Will this be considered a public charge? No. Okay, Ben Saleh on YouTube. Uh, my Canadian passport has expired and I've been waiting on my travel documents for almost five months now. How much longer will it take? I don't know. Charlene Kurthbert on Facebook. I did my SIG case for both my girls. I started the process in 2018. My younger daughter received her green card early last year, but the older one has not yet. She will be renewing her work permit in March three times now what's going on i don't know what's going on but if you did it right you, you should be doing a mandamus right now to force the issue t dave 305 on youtube uh how long does it take for an uh, vawa adjustment to be processed if the i360 and i485 filed concurrently about two years um felix burt on youtube my son arrived in the u.s on july 27 20 uh, 2007, and at the time he was 12 years old. Does he qualify for DACA? When did he come? July 20, uh, 2007. No, you had to be here June 15th, 2007. Liz Samuels mm -hmm. on YouTube. My dad applied for my uh, currently 19 years old permanent residency in the U.S. in August 2019 and still hasn't received residency. How long is the wait usually? The permanent resident filing for a 19 year old? Yes. The, the visas are current, so I don't know where the 19-year-old is, but the visas are current. Thanks for watching. For more Bradshaw Live, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.